Oh, hello there. Am I happy to see you? You know, it's been a while. Today is going to be quite a wild ride, and I'm happy to share it with you. With my extensive YouTube knowledge, I will be conducting yet another YouTube channel review. Join me as we take a look into the creator known as no other than Heckin' Steve! He hates you! He hates you too! You better believe he hates you, you sorry reseller scum! <laughs> well, that was quite exciting. So join me as we check out the wonderful, illicit, notorious Heckin' Steve. So first, we're gonna check out his banner. And uh, what we see here is Heckin' Steve gaming. You know, I, I like gaming. Uh, wrestling. You know, uh, and then stuff. You know, I've been really looking for stuff, so I like stuff. Stuff is pretty hard to find on YouTube, so I'm glad to have some stuff I can find here. And a cat wearing glasses with a tie. Maybe it's a stuffed wrestling cat, you know, maybe from a game like the Persona games or maybe Sim Pets. Who knows? Maybe it's Animal Crossing. So he has an Animal Crossing cat that wrestles and he's stuffed. So that works. I'm, I'm okay with that. Not too bad. If you look here at this picture, he's got a beard. That's always a good thing. Is it freaking C? Like freaking cool? Or is it Stevie Freak Inc? I mean, is it like his incorporation? Who knows, but whatever, Stevie Freak Inc has once, here we go again, guys. We got the Harry Tornado K subscribers again. 2.36K. Last time we thought maybe it was Canadian corn dogs. Canadian keto corn dogs. Maybe, maybe that's what he is. Maybe he's on a keto diet. Maybe he's trying to lose weight like me. Yeah, so let me again remind you I have way more than him. Yeah, he only has two, two and a half. <laughs> two and a half K Canadian cornbread keto subscribers. But I have a little over 700. All right, so here we are. We got a few videos. Let's see if there's Caleb Phoenix butt sale. What? I don't, I don't know. Maybe Caleb sold butts. I don't know. Um, okay, see, so he likes resellers. He talks about our, here's a reseller buying everything. Let's, let's check out this video. Nintendo Switch Online. Let's, let's check it out. Especially when you consider the absolute stack back Man, it's, it's kind of like a pretty good review. Let's sit for a second. There's still plenty of hit games we need to offer on the service. So today I want to share with you five games Nintendo Good B roll. It's pretty good. I mean, check out that voice. That's pretty good. Nintendo should travel back in time and remember how beloved this game is. Clean something that I could have for my family. So, so hey Elijah, if you could come in, I would like you to check out this channel. So, oh, stuff. You know, because they'll buy diaper if it uh, sells. So. Wow. <laughs> okay. Okay. That was quite a bit different than the uh, first video. Let's uh, let's see what else we have here. Okay, so might need to go on mute here. So I see now why people are saying he hates you. Like I said at the beginning, I just thought it'd be funny, but. I guess he doesn't like resellers. I mean, it looks like he doesn't like hunters. So right here we see he doesn't like hunters. Uh, maybe he's PETA. Let's see, I, I highly doubt he's PETA, but maybe uh, he could be PETA. Yeah, he he's definitely vegan. He does not eat meat, there's no way. So maybe that's all it was, maybe he's just vegan. Okay, so he's got a reseller tier list and I see here he's got Cody with a K, which is my top guy so let's see what he has here so something else i noticed here i think he may be a model for PETA, because this is obviously model material i mean check out check out those those shots he's got the the beautiful blue eyes i would say he's probably a model maybe that's why he's able to hate resellers Wait, wait, that looks like a model I've seen before too that obviously is a vegan as well. Is that the pickin' preacher? So he's gonna talk about me. 
All right, so what, what I see here is the anti... Let's pause this for a second. We see the Antichrist, diarrhea of the internet, would flip their grandma. That's pretty bad. He thinks they would resell their grandma. I hope that's what he means. And then fairly but... Fairly but. I, I guess that's not so bad. Maybe it's not permanently but. Fairly but and not too bad. Okay, so not too bad. So either way, a reseller is gonna be pretty bad, just not too bad. They're never gonna be good, okay? So, well, let's see, Let, let's fast forward and see. I mean, he, let's see, you know, Chase after right price, Harry Tornado? Maybe he's just mad because Harry, Harry Tornado's Diary of the Internet, maybe it's because he points so good. That could be what it is. See, here's a point, here's a point, point, point. He's pointing. He even knows how to use other things to point. We can learn how to point from him. Cody with a K's would flip their grandma. Man, I like Cody with a K. Okay, so I'm next here. So let's see where he puts me. A picket preacher, this guy's actually pretty cool. Not too bad. Not too bad, I, I guess. So he can't be that bad if he thinks the pick and preacher is not too bad. All right, so let's go back to his bio or his channel description. I can see why people are saying a YouTube channel focused on reseller criticisms and gaming. So I don't know if it means like reseller gaming or gaming criticisms, or maybe, I don't know. But where's the stuff? Cause that's what I'm looking for. I just wanna know where the stuff at. Give me the stuff. All right, so here we go. The views expressed in my content are entirely fictional for entertainment purposes only. Nothing I say should be taken serious by anyone. A picket preacher, this guy is actually pretty cool. So he really thinks I'm the Antichrist? All right guys, so here's the sum of things. Heck and Steve doesn't really like resellers, and from the looks of it, especially video game resellers. I've heard many of you have been dogged and roasted and trashed by him, and you know, that kind of sucks for you. But he does say don't take everything so serious. I think Heck and Steve is just misunderstood. He's really not that bad of a guy. Remember, most of it's satire, that's what he said at least. Don't let your kids watch it. You know, and maybe, Maybe you should mute it too. But enjoy the beautiful model. That's a little weird, coming from me. B but check it out, check out that beard. And listen guys, if he's ticked you off to such a point, you wanna give him a piece of your mind in an open forum where he has to respond immediately, get me to a thousand subscribers. But when I reach a thousand subscribers, heck and Steve is gonna come on my live. And don't worry, he said he'd keep it clean. Me and heck and Steve have kind of become, you could say, BFFs, best friends and I've been talking to him a lot and he's not so bad of a guy in fact by the end of this I don't think you'll have to worry about heckin Steve anymore because he's gonna be heaven and Steve oh!